Magnum P.I., which aired from 1980 to 1988, captivated audiences with its thrilling detective stories set against the beautiful backdrop of Hawaii. The ensemble cast of the show, led by the charismatic Tom Selleck as Thomas Magnum, created a dynamic and memorable team that became cultural icons. But the passage of time has seen the loss of some beloved cast members. Join Facts First as we take a look at the primary cast members of the show, both the ones still with us, as well as the ones who have since passed away. Tom Selleck Tom Selleck, born January 29, 1945, in Detroit, Michigan, has had a remarkable life and career as an actor. And while he starred in a number of shows and films, his portrayal of Thomas Magnum on Magnum P.I. first solidified his status as a TV icon. Selleck's breakthrough came in 1980 when he took on the role. Magnum was a charming and charismatic private investigator living in Hawaii, and the series, which ran for eight seasons, showcased Selleck's undeniable charisma, quick wit, and rugged charm, making Magnum one of TV's most beloved characters. Selleck's portrayal earned him critical acclaim, a dedicated fan base, and a primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Drama Series in 1984. Following the success of the show, Selleck went on to pursue a diverse range of roles in both film and television. Notable projects include his portrayal of Jesse Stone in a series of made-for-TV movies, which further showcased his versatility. He also made a memorable turn in the iconic sitcom Friends, playing Monica's boyfriend. It was a reminder of how Selleck's acting chops included sharp and fast comedy. Outside of his acting career, Selleck has also embraced other endeavors. He's been involved in political efforts, including serving as a spokesperson for the National Rifle Association, as well as actively supporting veterans' organizations. He's also been involved in the production side, both as an executive producer and as the star of his series like Blue Bloods, where he plays Frank Reagan, the New York City Police Commissioner. He's been married to Jilly Mack since 1987, and they have a daughter together named Hannah. Known for his privacy, Selleck has managed to maintain a relatively low-key personal life, focusing on his family and career. His portrayal of Thomas Magnum remains one of his most iconic, and his on-screen charisma and talent have made him a beloved figure for audiences worldwide. Roger E. Mosley Roger E. Mosley, best known for his portrayal of Theodore T.C. Calvin, led a remarkable life both on and off the screen. Born December 18, 1938 in L.A., Mosley found his passion for acting early on. His breakthrough came in 1980 when he was cast as T.C., the helicopter pilot and close friend of Thomas Magnum. His portrayal of the affable and easygoing T.C. resonated with audiences, becoming one of the show's most beloved characters. Mosley's chemistry with the ensemble cast, including Tom Selleck's Magnum, added depth and humor to the series, making it a perennial favorite. During his time on the show, Mosley's talent and charisma shined through, earning him critical acclaim and a loyal fan base. He brought a sense of warmth and authenticity to the role, making TC an integral part of the show's success. After the show ended in 1988, Mosley continued to showcase his acting prowess. He appeared in numerous TV shows, including guest appearances on popular series like Walker, Texas Ranger, A Different World, and Law and & Order. Mosley's ability to bring depth and authenticity to his characters made him a sought-after actor in the industry. In addition to his television work, he also made notable appearances in films. He played the character of Monk in the crime comedy film Terminal Entry, and he appeared in Heart Condition alongside Denzel Washington and Bob Hoskins. Mosley also directed and produced several projects. He directed episodes of Magnum P.I., as well as Touched by an Angel. His work as a director and producer further exemplifies his multifaceted contributions to the industry. Off-screen, he led a relatively private personal life. While details about it are not widely known, it is known he had children and cherished his family. He was known for his down-to-earth nature and his commitment to his craft. Tragically, Mosley was in a car crash on August 4, 2022, which left him paralyzed and in critical condition. He died three days later from the injuries sustained in the crash. He was 83. His legacy extends beyond his role on Magnum P.I. His talent, infectious smile, and genuine warmth endeared him to audiences. John Hillerman John Hillerman, best known for his role as Jonathan Quayle Higgins III, led a distinguished life as an actor. 
Born December 20, 1932, in Denison, Texas, Hellerman's career spanned decades, but it was his portrayal of the refined British estate caretaker that etched him into the hearts of audiences worldwide. Hillerman's breakout role was as Higgins, the stern yet sophisticated character who served as the estate manager and foil to Thomas Magnum. Hillerman's impeccable comedic timing and ability to bring a touch of gravitas to the role added some charm and depth to the series. During his time, his portrayal garnered him widespread recognition, including four Primetime Emmy Award nominations for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Drama Series, of which he won one in 1987. His chemistry with the ensemble, particularly his playful banter with Tom Selleck, created some of the show's most memorable moments. After the show ended, Hillerman continued to make notable appearances in both film and television. One of his notable post-magnum roles was in the series The Hogan Family, known as Valerie in its early seasons. He joined the cast in 1989, playing Lloyd Hogan, the charming and kind-hearted father figure. His portrayal in the show allowed him to showcase his comedic timing and warm presence. He also made guest appearances in numerous popular shows like Murder, She Wrote, Law and & Order, and The Love Boat. These roles further demonstrated his versatility and solidified his reputation as a respected character actor. He also appeared in several films, including Blazing Saddles, Chinatown, and High Plains Drifter. Outside of his acting career, he maintained a relatively private personal life. He was known for his professionalism and dedication to his craft, which garnered respect from his colleagues and industry peers. His love for theater and the arts was evident in his work and continued throughout his life. Tragically, he died on November 9, 2017, at age 84. Larry Manetti Larry Manetti, born July 23, 1947, in Chicago, is best known for his role as Orville Rick Wright on Magnum P.I. His career in entertainment began in the late 60s with small roles on various shows and films. His breakthrough came in 1980 when he joined the cast of Magnum P.I., Manetti's character, Rick Wright, was a Vietnam War veteran and one of Thomas Magnum's close friends. Rick's affable nature, charm, and expertise in running the King Kamehameha Club added depth and humor to the series. Manetti's on-screen chemistry with the ensemble, particularly Tom Selleck, contributed to the show's success. Later, he embarked on a career that allowed him to explore different roles and genres. He made guest appearances in shows like Walker, Texas Ranger, Jag, and Diagnosis Murder. He also ventured into film, taking on supporting roles in movies like Black Dawn and Hitters Anonymous. He even showcased his skills as an author. In 1996, he released his memoir, Aloha Magnum, Larry Manetti's Magnum P.I. Memories. He's also remained active in the entertainment industry through various hosting and radio ventures. He's hosted programs such as Lifestyles with Larry Manetti and Weekend Warriors, where he explored the world of luxury travel. Now it's time to hear from you. What's your favorite memory of Magnum P.I.? And who is your favorite character? Let us know in the comments section below.